I want to again express my deepest condolences to the families of those who died in Tuesday's terrible train derailment outside of Philadelphia. I want to express my gratitude for the first responders who raced to save lives and for the many passengers who, despite their own injuries, made heroic efforts to get fellow passengers to safety. You know, for a lot of people on that train, it was a routine journey, a commute, a business trip. For the Amtrak employees who were badly hurt, it was their office, a place of doing business, uh, and that somehow makes it all the more tragic. Until we know for certain what caused this tragedy, I just want to reiterate what I have already said, uh, that we are a growing country with a growing economy. We need to invest in the infrastructure that keeps us that way, and not just when something bad happens, like a bridge collapse or a train derailment, but all the time. That's what great nations do. Uh, so I offer my prayers for those who grieve, a speedy recovery for the many who were injured as they work to recover. And we will cooperate, obviously, at every level of government to make sure that uh, we get answers in terms of precisely what happened.